an extremely hard large cataract in an elderly gentleman topical anesthesia 2.8 translimbal keratome is made with a small congenital flap air followed by trypan blue you can see the zonula weakness all around i need to be extremely careful with handling the capsular bag and the zonules tunnel floor entry visco filled entry chamber there is no leak because of the entry is through the tunnel flow i am tentatively making a very large rexis so that i'm not going to jeopardize the zonules when i'm extracting the nucleus as the cataract is not bulging it, the rexis is pretty easy there is no fluid the entire thing is nucleus i'm enlarging the tunnel from 5.2 to about 0.75 mm on either side it comes to about 6 or even 6.5 lignocaine in the anterior chamber i am not doing hydrodissection lignocaine in anterior chamber is very small quantity is pushed towards the ciliary body taking care that i am not going to do the injection of lignocaine into the vitreous cavity the rotation of nucleus is done by manually and uh, it was pretty uh, adherent to the capsule but in spite of that i didn't create any additional damage to the zonules because the pull will be on the 360 degrees all all the zonules will be simultaneously stretch i am using a uh, snare positioned it in the middle of the nucleus and it's very easy to bisect it uh, with a snare i tried uh, uh, the small narrow vectis but uh, as you can see later it's not possible to remove it i'm continuously injecting viscoelastic so that the endothelium is protected against the moving nucleus it didn't come out the tunnel though it's larger is big even for a heminucleus so with a larger bile duct is i could remove it the other half had gone deeper in the capsular bag i'm positioning it in line with the tunnel and uh, easily it could be taken out this time the visco injection will minimize the any possible damage to the endothelium and uh, the cortex is uh, very little amount it's aspirated from the capsular bag when the nucleus is being removed you should take care that the iris uh, the distal iris is not involved included uh, between the nucleus and the wire vectis otherwise you'll have any the distal dialysis the cartridge is filled with viscoelastic the lens is first dipped in viscoelastic then the haptics are folded in front of the lens as you see here in the conventional way instead of using a the injector i'm using a rod that's a 16 gauge rod which i slide uh, along the floor of the uh, uh, cartridge so that the lens is injected it's a very smooth technique lens is not folded at all there is a slit in the cartridge top which will uh, reduce the damage to the lens cortex is aspirated and that's the end of surgery in spite of the phacodonesis and the weak zonules and the capsular bag it was possible to do the uh, cataract extraction in this very large nucleus cataract uh, uneventfully thank you